Hello Pisces, this is for my tarot here to do your reading for today. This is going to be for June the 3rd, 2020. I'm going to pull two article cards from the Psychic article deck. Hmm. A lot of you guys all about foundation and achievement. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. Some of you guys are suffering a emotional loss in a home. You got found foundation and achievement and emotional loss. Some of you guys are, are suffering this within a foundation or a home. It was the ending. Got a 10. Some kind of ending. A closure. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more, tell me more, tell me more, tell me more about this emotional loss and foundation achievement. Tell me more, spirit, tell me more about this for June the 3rd, 2020, no more, tell me more. Mm. So you guys have to make a decision about this, about this foundation, this home. Tell me more about this, tell me more, tell me more, tell me more, tell me more, spirit, tell me more. I'm trying to make a decision about this Queen of Wands. This is someone that could be a mother, someone very fiery, like nice things around them. This is a one that you pretty much cannot control. Tell me more. Tell me more about this. Tell me more about this emotional loss. Tell me more. Tell me more. So you make, you guys are making a decision. To work on things with this uh, Queen of Wands. You see this person as your wish fulfillment. This is someone that had betrayed you. You find this person back backstab you. Mm. Now you want to rush in and pursue this person. The roles can't be reversed. Some of you guys trying to rush in and pursue a Scorpio. Uh, or this is someone that you had an ending with. Hmm. This is someone that you had some conflict or disagreement with. It could have been a fight. You want a brand new beginning with this person. You want a fiery beginning with this person. And you want to tell the truth. You want to put everything on the line. You want to tell the truth. Tell me more about this Ace of Swords. What do you want to tell the truth about? Tell me more about this truth. Tell me more about this truth. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more about this truth. The truth is that you was in a third party relationship. You was in a loving family. You had a loving family. But now you're feeling left out and cold by your family. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. You feel like your, your spouse was hiding something from you. Was keeping secrets from you. Mm. That's why you have your walls up. Because of secrets and lies and things um, was hidden behind the scenes. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. This new beginning. Tell me more about this new beginning. Tell me more. You want to move to common waters with this person. The roles can't be reversed. This person can live at a distance. Uh, this is the one that you had a completion of a cycle with. You want to offer this person a stable commitment. This is someone that you manifest, or this is someone that you're feeling sad about. Tell me more about this. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. Tell me more. You want to 
balance things with this person. Some of you guys were dealing with a Libra. You want to sweep this person out their feet. You want to invite this person somewhere. Yeah, you try to make a final decision about this. You see this person as a player. That was juggling. That was juggling you and someone else. That's why you had to walk away. But you was watching the whole time. You watching that person or that person could have been watching you. You trying to be hopeful right now about this situation? And being deceitful? Tell me more. Why the seven of swords here? What? Tell me more. What is hidden? What is why the seven of swords here? Tell me more about the seven of swords. Tell me more about the seven of swords. You want to move forward with this empress that you see as your two of cups mm, that you've been thinking about. Start a new beginning. You see a loving, you see a, a family not worried about money with this person. So you want to win at, at all costs. Hmm. Tell me more, tell me more. This is someone from your past that you see happiness, happen, happiness with. You see the sun with this person. So you're trying to make a decision about this. Overall energy for Pisces. That you're trying to make a decision about overall energy for Pisces for June the 3rd, 2020. Let's get your overall energy. Mm. Some of you guys are dealing with a Capricorn. Something is toxic. Something y'all thinking about sex. Some kind of uh, obsessing over someone. Could be about sex. Maybe the sex was good to you or something. <laughs> oh, Lord, drive a car. <laughs> Mm. You're obsessing over this person that's going to be a boss or have their own business. Very bossy that you're holding on to. Oh, so you're obsessing over this person that you're holding on to that could be a boss. That is a king of pentacles. This is your ideal partner or wife that you want a relationship with. And this is someone that you had already planted your seed. Mm. This could be... You could have, uh, you could be the father of that person's kid, or someone in authority that you had already planted your seed. But you want to send that person a message on why you was being quiet, why did you have to take a break from this person, and you were struggling with this. That's why you was up at nighttime. You want to control your emotions about your ex. Hmm. Some of you guys are dealing with a Libra, not a Libra, but a Capricorn. I mean, I'm sorry, a Leo. That you cut out your life. That you pour all your emotions out to this person. This person will give it to two people. You want a reunion with this person. I'm getting all kind of different stories here. So you want a reunion with this person. Everything went fast. You want to communicate with this person. This is someone that you're trying to see things from a different point of view. That is very stable and grounded. Mm. You want to send a person a very uh, passionate message. Mm. I see all the signs here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius, Aries, Aries, Leo, Sag. Mm, I see all signs here. So if you like my readings, give me a thumbs up. And thank you guys for following my channel. Thank you. Until next time.